everyone and welcome to another craft video by Erin. Today I want to show you how to make this pleated medallion accent for your card. So let's get started. To start out with I'm going to use a piece of Twilight cardstock and Close to My Heart's 2 inch scallop punch. To add a little interest, I'm going to add a little bit of ink to the edges of the scallop using the direct to paper method. Next, I've got a half inch strip of Close to My Heart's pattern paper. This pattern paper comes from the Bliss packet that you can get from Close to My Heart. What I'm going to do is to make gathers at the bottom edge of the strip of paper. I'm not fussing with it too much. I'm just gathering it up so that it'll have some pleats. Now I'm going to add some adhesive to the center of the scallop circle just so when I start to lay down my pleated strip it'll have somewhere to stick. I'm going to attach this strip going in a circle pattern just trying to keep it about the same distance all the way around from the edge of the circle. When I get to the end here, I'm going to use the scissors and trim off any excess and then adding a little bit of adhesive, I'm going to fold that last little bit down. Next, I've got a sentiment that I have already put stamped using the Salutation Seal stamp set from Close to My Heart. One of the great things about this stamp set is that the images match up with the Close to My Heart punches. I'm going to use the inch and a quarter punch to punch out this sentiment. And then I'm going to use a little piece of foam tape right in the center of the pleats and attach the sentiment. Now I've already prepared my card so what I'm going to do is attach Oh, and I ran out of glue, of course. Well, I'll just attach it with glue dots since I ran out of glue. The next thing I want to do is attach one of these fabric flowers from the Close to My Heart Bliss Accents. They come in a package that looks just like this. You get three flowers 
and you get three metal butterflies with brads. If you'll notice, I made my flower just a little bit smaller because I didn't want it to be quite as big as my medallion accent. Um, one, just with a little bit of gentle tugging, I removed two layers of the flower off of the bottom and I'm going to save these because I think that they will look great on another project later on by adding a button to them. Now with a glue tot, I'm just going to attach this right to the card. And then I'm also going to use one of these metal butterflies. And I'm also going to attach it with a glue dot. I have just added the brad through the center and spread the prongs out to make it flat. And then I'm going to attach it right in there in the card. There you have it, a simple and easy medallion, pleated medallion. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.